Hey folks, Guys of Gamer here, and today we are back yet again with some Dynasty Warriors 7. Just kick my mic, I think it's okay. Continue, yes. We were just about to, oh god. Was lost. Cheers of joy from Liu Bei's army and his peasant followers flooded Lower Castle. There were no survivors. Liu Bei could not help but think that this was not the right path. But to avenge Pang Tong's death. And to answer the fervent desires of the people of Yi. Yes. Liu Bei yeah. advanced his army on the Yi capital of Chengdu. For he had finally made up his mind to attack Liu Zhong. Meanwhile, hearing of Pang Tong's death, Zhuge Liang left Guan Yu in charge of Jing and set out to join the battle. He joined up with Liu Bei, and together they looked to swiftly capture Chengdu. Driven by the lost dreams of his fallen friend and ally, the dragon would soar over the hills of Yi, where the feathers of the phoenix lay scattered in the wind. So yes, we have play as the enigmatic Zhuge Liang. As he does his little steppy steps. Province will be ours. It will be. Lord Liu oh. Bei will finally <laughs> his uh, jacket there kind of freaked out. And with the land divided in three, then I bring news. Good Lord Zhang Fei has gone to Lord Liu Bei's aid. Our troops await your orders. Very well. All forces. Advance. So chilled with it. I'm sending you to your deaths. <laughs> yeah, charge. All right. Um, I because I haven't played as him before. Wow. That's so good. I need to unlock some of ye old moves. Uh, she will get too much all of them. I imagine. Pretty much like once you start with one of them. Um, you know, all, all the XP carries over, or skill points, rather. Um, no, let's not give you smithing. Because who cares about smithing? Can I get speed? No, damn it. Okay. There's no generals that way. Begin marching toward our target. I do not want anybody to fall behind. <laughs> Firing my lasers. Oh my god, he's so bad at it. Oh, what the? Liu virtue is known to the people of this land. They would welcome his rule. Pong Tong's devotion showed me the truth. I have no doubts about this battle. <laughs> I love that. That's so badass. Alright, what's this about then? Casually just bringing on. Bring the thunder, literally. I like it. I think it went quite well. Uh, does that general run away from me? No. Fight me now for glory. What's uh what's my other Muso? <clears throat> Excuse me. Get up. Now is the opportune moment to strike. Wow. His day can go fucked up. Get them off my back. Ah He just steal my kill. This is not the end. There is no greater weapon nope, than fine. <laughs> I got it. I was like, what a bastard! He just stole my kill! Oh, I'm so fast. Look at me go! So yeah, I um, I actually completed the the, uh, the Wu campaign uh, yesterday, which is pretty good. So I will be doing a playthrough of that as well, because that was pretty badass. Wait, wait, where do I need to go? I need to stop them. I'm going to help this dude out in the castle first. And then we can all move out as a big happy family. Be nice. Be enjoyable. So yeah, I completed um, completed that. That was really good. So uh, it it was okay. And then the last few missions were really good. So I'm hoping that because the starting missions with this one have been better, that it's going to end up being a lot better at the end as well. Could be wrong. Could be shit. But hey, we can only hope. Just judging by the last few battles that Zhao Yun used to fight. There's one mission especially I don't think Such I'm going to get to fight, um, which is a shame. Me to um, I'm hoping... Did I kill a general there? Capture that gate. Okay. I attack that. Pull 
position. Okay. Go. Oh man, I, I love that. Just firing my lasers. Oh. Come on, guys. Oh, they're all running away. Form up. It's easier if you all come close to me. <laughs> I'm getting over here. Hey, drunk pig. So yeah, I'm really interested to see how they handle a few things. Um, you know, Guan Yu especially. For those who know the story, they'll know what I'm speaking about, but... Wrestle Floyd known in, in a wee bit. You <laughs> laser bitch. It's so badass. But it's it's really funny, because like, some of the... Some of the guys, when you look at them, they go, Oh, you know, that's not maybe not realistic, but like... Within legend kind of thing. You know, so like, this guy kills thousands of guys. It's like, yeah, he, he was probably a really good warrior, and he killed a, a lot of dudes. They've just, you know, expanded it. Fair enough. But like, with some of the... Some of these guys, you're like, yeah, you just shot lasers out of your fan. I don't think that's realistic. I'm not okay with this. I've pretty good range on this as well. Whoa. But it basically is, so... How about that? I'm really glad Juge Leong is uh, pretty badass. It should be. It should be badass. Um, I played through the Wu campaign, though. There's a lot of guys who are just kind of like very underwhelmed with. You can fight on if you like, but it is pointless. Under its current rule, Yi Province is doomed. You believe your wits are a match for mine? There you go. I thought. Sorry, stay quiet because they were speaking, but I thought maybe um, they were going to turn. Um, quite a few times I've been fighting guys and is on his way to assist the enemy. He is approaching from the north. Okay, what do you want me to do? After I hate when they just mentioned it. By Cao Cao, I heard that Ma Chao was working for Ah, uh, okay. Zhong Lu is not worthy of him. It would be quite a coup if we could acquire his services. It would be. Report. It seems that the Allied reinforcements have arrived. Hooray. Lord Zhao Yun is heading for Ma Chao to talk with him. What he nice is guy. taking Lord Li Hui, who knows Ma Chao well. If they play their cards right, we could acquire ourselves a very powerful ally. I hate fucking archers, my god. Even on the... Uh, even on easy, archers just a pain in the ass. Such a display will boost the morale of our troops. Take this to the captain to get this place. Oh, he's dead. Oh, he's dead. Huh. I thought he was. I was waiting for him to get up. I missed. There we go. It's fine. So, is this gate going to open or. Ah. Okay. Uh, still the fans, captains. I think I have to take them out. Hey, I missed. Wow, that's a big fan. I thought my fan was big, but. Damn, Fa Zhang. Damn. This area is merely a pawn in my larger overall strategy. Alright. <laughs> Cheers for that. Why are these guys just waiting outside? You guys can come in and help. You know that, right? Report! It seems that the enemy reinforcements have arrived. Let me go down this way. I think. Honestly, they do not know which way they want me to go. And uh, this is the only way it's kind of open, so... Go down here. Try to help these folks out. You believe your wits are a match for Epic. <laughs> do it again. Why not? There we go. Hooray! And then all these guys spawn out of nowhere, chase after them. 
Uh, Lu Bei's in there. He's pretty safely locked in there, I think. So, who are these dudes? Dangji. Okay. But do I have any units over there? Zhao Yun's over there. I'm gonna go help out Zhao Yun. This area is merely a pawn in my larger overall. Strategy. Oh hey, shit's an archers. Oh, it's not archers. <laughs> I can't see. Hooray! I was gonna run past it. Fuck it. It's not worth it. Let's just run around here, like the speeding demon I am. Hey guys, my friends. You appear to be a confident fighter. However, I will not now be easily defeated. I'm sure you won't. Although you're half out, but you know, I'm sure I'm sure you get back on your feet. It's fine. It's alright. You can still win this. Ah, oh, he's dead. Oh well. It's a shame, buddy. Apologies. Oh well. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. Dude, my classic strategy of fuck the troops. Let's just uh, let's just run. Whoa. They are indeed. I am counting on you. Now is an opportune moment. Ma Chao is an honorable man. If we plead the righteousness of our case, he will join us. Okay, we'll do that. Please. Please and thank you. Whoa, ow. You have earned my respect. This thing's some of the war machines you get in this are fucking ludicrous. Hey. Oh, I'm about to pull up both my headphones. <laughs> Quick. And I put them in the wrong ears. Because, you know. Victory is mine! Okay, here we go. So we figured out. <laughs> what the fuck am I saying? <laughs> we helped out Zhao Yu. I shouldn't say we helped out and freed out. Or freed up, rather. Yeah, there we go. Oh shit, there's some serious generals uh, around. <laughs> Lu Bei, and I did not realize. Um, let's just quickly run past these kids. Fight this kid up here. Hopefully killing this dude will... You your wits are a uh, hopefully that will open up the doors. Probably will. Hopefully he gets hurt by this. There we go. Eyes. There we go. There's Lu Bei. Oh, you realized I was in danger. I am sorry for burning. <laughs> okay. Oh, you realized I was. What the fuck? <laughs> that was ludicrous. Oh, you making a mistake. Your blade should be pointed at Cao Cao. He was the one who murdered your father. Lord Liu Bei stood by your father and fought off Cao Cao. You're right. I've been a fool. My enemy is Cao Cao. Lord Liu Bei should be my master. Hooray! That was easy. For your assistance, Lord Machado. Together we will build the world our Lord dreams of. <laughs> that was, I love how easily they're convinced sometimes. It's like, yeah, you should join with us because you know we're nice and shit. It's like, yes, you are nice and shit. Ah. I've missed that dude. No, no, I've heard. Oh wow, defeat a thousand. Sweet. I fell just short um, the entirety of the Wu campaign and I just casually collapsed it with uh, Zhuge and Leon, so hey, hey! Happy times. Ow. I always find it funny when one of the random dudes just pops up and gets a cheeky hit on you. You're like, wait, what? You hit me? Oh. Okay, I guess. Fair enough, hold on. Looks like it's just troops fucking everywhere. Uh, there's a general over here. Although that general's surrounded, so... I missed! Hey! I've been mean, pretty quiet in this one just because I've been concentrating. I've actually been really enjoying fighting as... Um, <laughs> it's Yugi Leong, it's fucking badass. Panic is spreading in Liu Zhong's ranks. He's ace. Some men have already fled the castle. I'm not surprised. Just 
these guys, oh, they, these are the fleeing dudes. Okay, cool. Bye. No chase them, fuck's sake. Run in here. You have not the power to rule this land. Do you still insist on fighting? My lord, there is no point in fighting on. Accept defeat and surrender. I never thought you would side with the enemy, my child. To your point though, like, he's surrounded, why doesn't he just stop? You kinda fucked me. You're not winning this. Especially when I've got magic and shit. You're welcome. And you bet. He is great enough. But he's got a white horse, of course he is. A benevolent ruler. With Chengdu in his hand. That is what Lord Liu Bei has become. Oh. All was proceeding just as Juga Be great if Lu Shang was like, but it's mine! <laughs> That's a little straw, you know. As Liu Bei captured Yi, claiming the territory as his own. And the land found itself divided into three, with Liu Bei of Shu, Cao Cao of Wei, and Sun Quan of Wu. At long last, Juga Liang's three kingdom strategy had come to fruition. Against this backdrop, the province of Jing, located at the center of these three kingdoms, grew more important than ever. While relations between Shu and Wu had worsened as they fought for control of the province, that all changed when Wei invaded Hanzhong. Yu Bei proposed a ceasefire with Sun Quan and returned to him the eastern portion of Jing. And in return for the land, he asked that Wu participate in a joint attack against Wei at Hefei. Just as they promised, Wu attacked Hefei. For a while, Jing once again knew peace. Having secured Jing, Zhuge Liang sent Huang Zhang and other top generals to take the fight to Wei. The battle would take place on Han Zhang's Mount Dingjuan. It was there that Zhuge Liang realized Mountains are big and shit. The land of virtue no, they had sought no. for so long was finally within their grasp. Sweet. So, thank you much for watching, folks. And I'll catch you in the next when we fight as. Hi oh, wait, no. I forgot there's a cutscene. Damn it. <laughs> the enemy ranks are as clear as day. It's because it's daytime, mate. <laughs> That's quite a shot. Is it so red or something good? It's too far. There's no point. <laughs> How's he shooting that bow and arrow? Unless you're as good as me. Don't shoot the camera. Oh no, it's um XO Juan. Something like that. <clears throat> Securing Han Zhong will bring stability to the kingdom of Shu. Nice. After all, even we old folks have to think about the future sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I hope you will join me in the next part when I shoot a bow and arrow for hours. So thanks for watching, folks. I'll catch you in the next. See you later.